everyone a very cheerful good morning to all the cute faces out there i hope you are in a good state of health today we are going to start with a very interesting and a very basic topic that is the noun the noun what is a noun the noun is basically the naming words what are the naming words you know students everything in this whole world has a name name of a person animal place or a thing everyone is denoted with a name like name of a person is harry radha geeta sam and you can call it by many different names name of an animal maybe it's a dog it's a cat it's a rat it's a giraffe name of a place like delhi paris america new york name of a thing basket razor sharpener you can call by various names you also have a name your parents has given you a name na the teacher also calls a student by a name so everything in this whole world is denoted by a particular name now let's see the examples and definitions through the given thing what is the definition a noun is the name of a person animal place or a thing i repeat once again a noun is the name of a person animal place or a thing as i have told you before that in order to make our life easy we have given different names to give different things places persons and animals Let's see through the example. Boy is playing. So here, boy is also a name. It's a category that of a person. Now, second, the cow gives milk. What is the cow? Cow is the category of animal. And what is milk? It's a thing. Very right. Third example. Ritu lives in Pyas. What is Ritu? Ritu is the name of a person. And what is Pyas? Pyas is a place. Okay. So here, these examples shows that everything in this world has a name, and it's very important to have. Without name, we can't even to call a person or a thing. So students. Now let's see through some colorful pictures. Now here, students, let's go through the definition once again, and then we'll study it through some examples. A noun is the name of a person, animal, place, or thing. Anil, who is Anil? Anil is the name of a person. Tree, tree is the name of thing. cat cat is the name of a animal kettle kettle is a thing table table is also a thing mysore mysore is the name of a place similarly father ants dog books earth sun these all are the names of person animal place or thing now let's move on this is the first category of a noun that is person here girl teacher man boy doctor baby these all are common nouns but if we know their names properly like teacher anu man ram girl sita doctor mr ramesh so these are called proper nouns now let's move on place this is the second category of a noun place where we want to go where we live like house library paris restaurant cinema these all are places where you have gone sometime 
Let's move on to the next page. Thing. This is the third category of a noun. Like pen, guitar, bottle, bicycle, clock. These all are things which comes into the category of non-living. Now let's move on to the next page. This is the fourth category. That is of animal. Here's the name of different animals like bear, lion, monkey, tiger, mouse. They are all the names of animals. Now children, let's do some joyful activity. Here there are different pictures and you have to tell me which category does this picture belong? Now first is what? Peacock. Oh, select the right one. It is a person, place, animal or a thing. Tell me. Yes, it's an animal. Now the second one is the star. What is it? Is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes, it's a thing. Hotel. Do you stay in the hotel? Is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes, students, it's a place. Ooh, who is a nurse? Is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes, it's a person. Post box. Yes, where you post the letters. Is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes, it's a thing. Now the next is nest. It's a person, place, animal or thing? It is a thing. Yes, nest is a thing. Very right. Now let's move on. Oh wow, what is it? Red in color. You eat it? An apple a day keeps a doctor away? It is a person, place, animal or thing? Yes, it's a thing. Amritsar. Is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes, it's a place. Very right. Rabbit. Is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes. It's an animal. Mother. Oh, mother. It's, is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes. It's a person. Grandfather. Similarly, is it a person, place, animal or thing? Yes. Is also a person. Lastly, the books. Person, place, animal or thing? Yes, these are things. Now let's children. Now students, take out this book of your English grammar, page number 13, exercise number 1 and lesson number 7. We'll start with exercise number 1. Now here, in exercise number 1, we have to pick out the nouns in the following sentences. The first one is, the cow gives milk. So here, two nouns are there, cow and milk. Children, I have given the pictures for your proper understanding. So here the answer is, underline it with me, cow and milk. In the second sentence, mice fear cats. So here, there are the two names of the animals, that is mice and cats. Very right. Third part, ants are always busy. So here, the name of the animal is ants. Underline it with me. Fourth part, the ink is in the ink pot. The name of the thing, two things are there. Ink and ink pot. Again, I'll repeat. First answer is cow and milk. Second one, mice and cats. Third one, 
ants, fourth ink and ink pot. Now let's move to the fifth part. My books are in my desk. So here two things are there, books and desk. So here we have to underline books and desk. Sixth part, the sun is in the sky. Two nouns are there, sun and the sky. Underline it, sun, sky. Seventh part, bread is made from flour. So here bread and flour, two nouns are there. Underline it with me. Bread, flow. Eighth, the earth goes round the sun. Here, two nouns are there again. Earth and sun. In the ninth part, the dog ran after the thief. Here, the thief is the name of a person and the dog is the name of the animal. So two answers are there. Dog and Thief. I'll repeat once again. Fifth answer is books and desk. Sixth one, sun and sky. Seventh, bread, floor. Eighth, earth, sun. Ninth, dog, thief. Now let's move to the tenth part. Birds build nests in trees. So here, Three answers are there. Birds, nests, trees. Eleventh, the wolf killed the goat. So here, what's the answer? Underline it with me. Wolf and goat. Twelfth part, I see a bird on that tree. Here, the noun is bird. Tree. Thirteenth, I have a green parrot. Here, green parrot are the nouns. I'll repeat once again. Tenth, birds, nests, trees. Eleventh part, wolf, goat. Twelfth, bird, tree. Thirteenth, green parrot. Now let's move to the 14th part. Is there any water in the pot? So here there is two nouns. Water, pot. As you can see in the pictures. 15th. Foxes lives in holes in the ground. Here there are three nouns. Foxes, holes, ground. 16th part. Hurry wrote a letter to his father. Here the noun is. Hurry, letter, father. I'll repeat once again. 14th part, water, pot. 15th, foxes, holes, ground. 16th, hurry, letter, father. Now the first exercise is completed. Come to the second one. In the second exercise, there are different pictures and we have to complete the missing letters. Now children, see the first picture. What's the picture? Yes, very right. It's a picture of a shoe. So next right. S-H-O-E. Shoe. In the next picture, what's that? Kettle. Very good. K-E-T-T-L-E. -T -T -E. Now in the next picture, what's there? Aunt. A N T. Aunt. In the next picture, what's there? Very right. Star. S T A R. Oh, in the next picture, what's that? Is the singular of teeth? Tooth. T double O T. H. Oh, what's this? This is an I. E. Y. E. In the next picture, who is there? She's a nurse. N. U. R. 
S E Nos. Oh, what is this? This is a tent. T E N T. I'll repeat once again. It's a picture of a shoe. Next is kettle. Next one is ant. Next is star. Next one is tooth. Next is eye. Next one is nose. And the next one is tent. Now let's move on. In the next picture, what's this? Yes, eyes. In the next picture, rabbit. R A B B I T. In the next one, it's an ox. In the next one, iron. Do you know what is an iron? Your mother presses clothes with this. Next one is a ladder. L A W D E R. What's that? Yes, very right. It's an ear. What's that? Oh, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Very right. It's an apple. In the next picture, what's that? Yes, it's a leaf. In the next picture, yes, it's a needle. Next, what's that? It's rain. In the next picture, what's this bottle? Ink. In the last picture, what's that? Nail. Very right. I'll repeat once again. Ice. Rabbit, ox, iron, ladder, ear, apple, leaf, needle, rain, ink, nail. Now let's move on to the last exercise. In this exercise, there is a crossword puzzle and you are seeing the picture and we have to fill the names. Now here, what is this? It's a train. Yes, very good. So here, we'll fill train. T-R-A-I-N. What is here? Cat. So C-A-T. So here the puzzle is solved. This is train and this is a cat. Here in the next picture, what's that? Car. Very good. Car. And here, fan. F-A-N. This puzzle is also solved. In the next picture, what's that? Oh, he's a man. Here, what is that? Yeah, bag. B-A-G, bag. In the next picture, what's that? Which fruit is that? It's an apple. A double P L E apple and what's that? That's a lamp. Very good. So this puzzle is solved. I'll repeat once again. That is train and cat. That is car and fan. That is man and bat. That is lamp and apple. Now in this B part, there are different pictures. You can see here different pictures are there. And we have to write their first letter. And by combining the first letters, we'll get the name of this picture. So let's do that. What are these? These are shoes. Start with S. You like the S? What is this? This is a hen. Hen starts with H. What is this? You like it? Oh, this is an ice cream. Ice cream starts with I. 
What is this? Use it for rubbing. It's a rubber. Very good. And last, what is this? All of you know that's a tree. So the first letters are combined, and what is this called? S H I R T. What is that? That's a shirt. Very good. So here we'll combine and write as a shirt. Very good. Now in the next picture, what's that? That's a dog. So the first letter is D. In the next one, what's that? That is ruler. Ruler, the first letter is R. What's that? That's an egg. First letter is E. Now what's this big thing? That's a ship. So the first letter is S. What's that? That's a stick. So the first letter is also S. So after combining, what do we get? Yes, very good. That's a dress. So here students, I'll repeat it once again. That is S H I R T shirt. Now next is D R E double -S, S S dress. So this is all with all the three exercise. I hope you liked my session. Once again, I'll repeat with the noun. What is a noun? A noun is a name of a person, animal, place, or thing. So we have to give. The names to all the things which we have. It's very important for us. I hope you enjoyed my session. Have a good day. Thank you.